Maureen and welcome to my kitchen and another product share Saturday. Today our video is sponsored by the folks at Cuisineware and they sent me this fantastic, super durable, um, like I'm so impressed at the quality, salad spinner. Now I know you're thinking everybody has a salad spinner. How can it be better? I'm going to share that with you. But today we're going to do a video using the salad spinner and we're going to do a weekly salad prep. I'm going to show you how I prep all of my veggies for our weekly salads that we have with our dinners. Sometimes we throw together a salad for lunch. But this way all of our veggies are prepped and ready to go. And I'm going to show you how I do that. And I'm going to show you how we use the Cuisiware salad spinner to get the job done on our greens and we're even going to spin some carrots in here. So let's go see how this all works. Now I'm going to go ahead and get to the greens and we're going to talk a little bit about our Cuisiware salad spinner. I'm going to prep my romaine lettuce. I'm just going to go around each rib I see. I'm just going to make a slice. And then I'm just going to cut it in bite-sized lengths. So I have my lettuce all ready to go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put it under the water and I'm going to give it a good rinse. We're going to go ahead and pop this basket in here. Lettuce tends to hold a tremendous amount of water. And um, you want to spin it off before you store it. Otherwise, it's going to get super soggy, and nobody likes soggy lettuce. You want your lettuce to be crisp and delicious. So what this spinner, how the spinner works is it has a little lever. You're going to pop it, you're going to slide it over, and your handle's going to pop up. It, it has like a one-press technology, okay? So, and you're just going to spin it until your lettuce is dry. Let me show you how much water has come off of that. Quite a bit. You can see how much water spun off that lettuce. There we go. Now your lettuce is ready to store however you like. I'm going to store mine in this container in my fridge. Nice and fresh. You'll be able to reach in there. But I'm not done because I want to spin my spinach. You want to make sure that you uh, spin your spinach because if you don't, it's going to get super soggy. Clean it the day that you buy it, okay? Before you even put this away, take a few minutes, wash it real quick with a colander, spin it, and get all that water off of it. So now we've got all of our salad greens ready to go. Sometimes it's a good idea when you do greens like this, you can just place a paper towel in there, just like this. And that's going to absorb any residual moisture that may be hanging out on your greens. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a couple paper towels. I'm going to stick them in the basket. And then I'm going to take my carrots. You don't want your carrots flying through the basket. I am going to rinse them with the paper towels right in there. I'm going to pop it back in the spinner and I'm going to give it a couple of spins. <clears throat> so, and there is a lot of water left on those. There you go. Here's all of our weekly salad prep ready to go. We got all of our veggies prepped and ready. Our greens mix is ready to go. Our cukes are washed. Our mini tomatoes and our regular tomatoes are ready to go. Everything that's going to go in the fridge is going in the fridge. The tomatoes are going to sit out on the counter so we can enjoy them when we want. Our carrots are clean and ready to go and they're going to stay crispy and not get soggy sitting in that bag. And we did it with the help of the Cuisiware salad spinner. So I wanted to go over a couple of things with you. When you order this, you're also going to get this really nice cookbook. It's got several different salad ideas in it and it's got a hardcover 
with the spiral binding and it's, it's actually really a nice quality cookbook. The salad spinner offers a flawless one-handed operation. Um, one thing I did want to show you is this little button here. If you want to stop it, you just press down and that's a little break. And it has a non-slip silicone base. I did not show you that, but I will right now. There is a silicone ring on the bottom that will help it to prevent from slipping when you're trying to get everything done. Um, it has a super large capacity. It's 5.2 quarts, so it's, it holds over a gallon of produce or whatever you're trying to do in there. And Queasyware has an ironclad, zero-risk, 100% money-back guarantee for 60 days and a 12-month replacement guarantee if you have any problems with your particular spinner. But I thought it might be fun to go ahead and do this video and show you how I do weekly salad prep and use the salad spinner as an extra added bonus. The folks at Queasyware are offering you a discount coupon code which is going to give you six dollars off the purchase price and I'm going to use a link I'm going to put it down below and then you're going to be able to go check it out for yourself and if you use the coupon code that I put in the information box you're going to get six dollars off so I hope that you are encouraged to go and have a look at the Amazon page where Queasyware has set this up and if you are interested in adding one of these to your kitchen repertoire I hope you'll consider it. I really like it. If it were crap I would tell you and it's not. This is really good quality and I really am impressed by this piece of equipment. Um, so I hope if you need one you'll go check it out. I hope that if you get one that you love it, leave me a comment down below if you pick one up and let me know how you feel about it. If you like the video, please consider giving me a thumbs up. And if you're not already, please be sure to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on all of our real food for real people, real easy recipes that we present every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday here on our channel and right from our kitchen. And every Saturday, we always try and share some great product that we've even either been sponsored to present or that we just absolutely love. So I hope that you'll come back and visit us. I hope if you try it, you love it. And until next time, I'll see ya.